If you've ever looked at all of those flash chases from the bloopers, you'll know that they are not nearly as cool as the ones in the movies. That's why in this video, we'll be taking a look at how they simulate the flash runs, how they film them, and the gray suits they use for their character. And of course, they're all hilarious. So without further ado, here's what the flash really looks like behind the scenes. Let's dive right into it, shall we? Number 15. Gorilla Grodd scratching his butt. For our first pick, we choose to go with the smartest creature primate in the Flash universe, Gorilla Grodd. And even though he's really smart on the set, behind the scenes, this is not actually the case. Because as soon as you can see here, during the short break, the actor that was playing Grodd just turned his back on the camera and started scratching his butt. And while the show's version of the gorilla is great, we can't say the same about the gray suit. It looks big, bulky, and impractical. However, it gets the job done. Number 14. The Shark King Dance From one giant villain to the next, this time we have the Shark King. But it's not the actual finished version that made it on the show. Oh no, this is the computer-generated silhouette of the Shark King that needs way too much editing before he can come anywhere near the episode. You might see him smashing stuff in the show, but in this footage, the Shark King showed us his funny side. The actor started dancing on set, and that morphed, incomplete version of the Shark King looks insanely funny, especially with that goofy dancing. Number 13. Here's what The Flash running looks like without CGI. If you are a fan of the show, you know one of the coolest things about it are all of the Barry Allen running moments. And we know they look cool on the screen, but have you ever wondered how these scenes are actually shot in the studio? Well, this video will give you a perfect example. If you look at this scene, you will instantly recognize this hallway. It's where Barry Allen smashed that like button if you haven't done so already. But no, it's actually where Barry zooms by at the speed of light and little sparks of lightning fly behind him. But this is what Grant Gustin looks like doing the scene without any CGI. Thank God they have VFX, otherwise it would be Barry Allen waltzing around the set all the time. Number 12. The Suit Upgrade That Didn't Light Up Vibe is the genius running the entire lab, and he's the one responsible for creating the Flash suit. And in the second season, he made an upgrade to the original Flash suit. Proud of his accomplishment and wanting to surprise Barry, he decided to make the big reveal. But there was one little problem. The darn light wouldn't turn on. This means that no one could see the suit and they had to redo the entire scene all over again. You see, folks, behind the scenes, things aren't always as smooth as in the show. Made a little upgrade to your suit. Hmm. <laughs> can you see it? Can, can you see the upgrade? Number 11. Zoom has a little fun with his costume. This might be a cringe moment for some, while it's a really funny one for others. You see, Zoom, the evil speedster that wanted to kill Barry in season two, had this great costume, especially the part with his mouth where it seemed like his lips had blended in together. So the actor decided to do a little joke. He stuck his tongue out in the middle of the shoot and Grant burst out laughing. But he didn't get the same reaction from his female co-star. She was kind of grossed out by him sticking his tongue out like that. <laughs> Wait, do that again, look at him. <laughs> Number 10. The Flash isn't that fast on the set. We told you the actors don't look cool behind the scenes, and this is a prime example. While Barry looks cool zapping through rooms on the shows, in real life, his biggest problems are the doors. In this scene, right when he was supposed to run out the room, he actually hit his shoulder in the door. Seems like the Flash is not as fast as he seems on the big screen. There's the door. Number nine. Here's another example to prove it. And this one is all about those intense scenes where the Flash and the villain go head to head in a crazy fast chase. On the set, however, 
the story is much different. After all, they don't really have those cool CGI in real life. When you have LGI life-generated imagery, you tend to just run around the set, chasing your co-stars, hoping that you look just as cool as you do in the movie. And the sad part is, they didn't look cool. Hilarious, but not cool. Number 8. Not so cool behind the set. This one is not about Barry, it's about Cisco instead. He looks cool with those goggles on the show, but as we said a couple times earlier, this is not the case on the set. When you do a lot of running and jumping around, things don't stay in place. And this was the case with his superhero goggles. They started falling off his nose, so Carlos had to stop the scene and put them in place. At least it turned out awesome in the movies. Number 7. Simulating the Flash Runs Do you know that gush of wind that fills the lab whenever Barry Allen zaps through the room? Well, every time you see it, just know that there is a guy with a fan standing in the background, blasting air in the face of the actors. Here's one. Here's another one. We could say that this second one is overdoing it a little with all the paper flying around, but it was a great addition in the show. We didn't even think about what went on behind the scenes. They have to do these scenes multiple times if someone messes up their lines. Try picking up all those pieces of paper from the floor 10 times and see if it's cool. Number 6. There's no need for the flash pants. This is the magic of the camera. When the director doesn't need a shot of the entire actor, just the torso, Grant Gustin could be buck naked below, as long as he has the right suit on where the shot is. And this is exactly what happened in this shot. Now, don't get us wrong, Grant wasn't actually naked, he was actually wearing shorts underneath. It's so tough getting the flash suit on, so they avoid going through the hassle of putting it on, even if that means looking ridiculous on set. Number 5. They're so fast they can hardly keep their balance. Man, these chase scenes are funny behind the scenes. This one is of Barry Allen and his daughter chasing after another bad guy. Or were they? You see, what the camera caught was something completely different from what we saw in the show. Just as Jessica Parker was getting ready to run at the speed of light, she tripped and fell right on the set. What did Grant do? He burst out laughing, just like us. Come on, let's go. Good. <laughs> Number 4. Sith Lord Barry Allen This is what actors have to deal with when CGI are part of the shot. They have to pretend there is an object that's not actually there. Grant had a little fun with this. He said that he felt like a Sith Lord during these scenes, and he's damn right. But that's for the movies. Behind the scenes, he just looks silly. And we don't really know what was all that lizard-like behavior in the end. But hey, whatever gets him going. I feel like a Sith Lord when I throw lightning. <laughs> Number 3. What the Flash chases are really like this is how the crew shoots those intense side-by-side -side chases that Barry often does with one of his speedster enemies. They put the actors in a green room, they get them running in place next to each other, and then they start talking. But you know Grant can't keep a straight face whenever someone messes up their lines. And to make everything even funnier, he actually stuck his tongue out. We were so close to seeing him make out with the camera lens. Number 2. Vibe trying to be the Flash himself We told you that green rooms are a lot of fun, but in this one, Carlos is the one that's being a joker. Instead of running off camera, he ran around Grant. We suppose he wanted to look just like the Flash when he creates that powerful vortex. And when Grant finally saw what he was doing, he couldn't hold it anymore. Number 1. That Barry screamed through And we saved the best for last. To prove once and for all, that Grant is such a goofball on the set. We have this scene. The directors are using a green screen whenever they need to shoot some of the flash runs. But when he saw that camera, he screamed like a hysterical woman right on the set. Guess who had to retake that shot? <laughs> and on that note, we end this video. But hey, which of these behind the scenes shots did you think was the best? You can tell us in the comments section below. If you'd like more videos like these, 
don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you never miss any of them. And as always, thanks for watching, guys.